It is the dawn of a new day in England, a new era of peace. The country stands unified, free from the rebellion of years past. While military triumphs abroad have made England a power unrivaled among the nations of the world. Towns flourish in this time of growth and prosperity, becoming influential centers of trade. And the people grow strong under the firm but gentle yoke. And in this magical realm, not one slave's mind harbors rebellion, not one peasant's dreams bend murderous, and the lips of every lord affirm as king the man who thieved the crown. You would have us believe this rot, John Lackland. Come, John. Surely you must have known we would require proof of Richard's death before we'd give consent to have you crowned king. I'd sooner crown a cockerel than this liar. King Richard languishes in a foreign cell, awaiting ransom still. All England knows his brother John's intent is not to free him. What proof is there that Richard lives? We have John's word that he does not. And even if Richard were alive, who among us would have his return? Longsword? Richard's fate is of no consequence. The fate of England, however, is. And while I live, this clumsy child will not be seated upon England's throne. Who then, Wolfric the Wild? You? Better die than you, Mark de Rampain. Has it come to this then? Guards, these men are traitors. We would, they were executed immediately. But wait, wait. <laughs> what, what, what is the meaning of this? No. A new day in England, indeed. Excellent. Quite a haul. And so did the merry men soundly defeat their nemesis, that rascally scoundrel, the Sheriff of Nottingham, once again. <laughs> and of his person they did thus. They bound him firmly to an ass in the fashion they'd fixed a fell deer. Being sure to have attached a letter to the wicked Sheriff's wife, gifting her, 
with said ass. The sheriff or his steed? The donkey, of course. Of the two, the more useful and the less an ass. <laughs> Better we should kill him than expect his company in another two weeks' time. Stay, Will. We are, as always, gracious hosts. We need to talk. A moment, love. Farewell, Sheriff, until next we meet. Let it rabbit his cheek right up! <laughs> Hi, if your gaping mouths could trap merchants' purses, we'd be far better served. Back to your posts, you wretches! <laughs> Nothing but a sham.